hey what's up you guys so um this is uh, my vlog that for this week um pretty much this is today is june the 22nd um so yeah I'm starting my vlog so i pretty much i just finished um get a life uh, get a life chloe brown by talia hibbert love this book so much now um i just got into this book um which is dear haiti love elaine due to the caribbean i know the caribbean probably has been i just wanted to dedicate at least one book or i re have read another book that i think could have fit um pretty much the prompts for the caribbean but i want to go ahead and read this as well i know i'm behind schedule but i want to go ahead and read it anyway because i want to read it it seems like a very interesting book uh, but like i said this is dear haiti love elaine by um, micah malite and maritza malite um so yeah i've already started it a little bit not that far off um but yeah so stay tuned for more you guys i'm sort of really tired um I'm just in my little chair, just chilling, just trying to get some reading time in as much as I can. Um, but yeah, so stay tuned for more, you guys. Hey, what's up, everyone? It's the 23rd, and I'm going to be quite honest with you. I did not really get any reading done today. Can you believe it? Because <laughs> I can. Um, but I did a lot of self-care, pretty much. Um, my husband let me get my nails done um he was really 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 concerned since of COVID-19 and you know everything has opened back up um but he was able he, was, he let me get my nails done so I'm I'm happy but yeah I got my nails done today so <laughs> I know like I had to get them done I haven't had my nails done since March and everything like that so Stay tuned, you guys. Maybe I'll read a little bit tonight before I go to bed. But right now I'm cleaning up because it looks a hot mess right now with my kids. And they just got a bath. So we're going to put them to bed. So, yeah. What's up, everyone? What's up, everyone? <laughs> I'm officially now in bed. Um, it's like 12 in the morning. Um, Eastern Standard Time. Um, I pretty much changed up my whole like TBR in a way for June. Um, due to the fact because I had received some good books today, or yesterday, 23rd, um, because one of the books that I've been anticipating came out on the 23rd, and so I'm changing up what I originally was going to read. So since I was reading, you know, uh, the book <laughs> Get a Life, Chloe Brown, I received the second book in the mail. So, you know, what I'm going to start reading is this, which I have. So, yeah. So, pretty much, I went from Get a Life, Chloe Brown to this book. I know I was reading, supposed to be reading the other book, um, Dear Love, Dear Elaine Love Haiti. I forget the title because I'm so tired. Um, but I I will get to with the book. I just don't know when because I've been wanting to read this uh, since the first book. So, yeah. So pretty much after reading the first book, I'm jumping into the second book. So I thought that probably be a good idea to do. But yeah, so I'm going to read some more of this and then go to bed. So I will see you guys tomorrow. Hey everyone, it's the 24th. I'm so tired right now. I read a little bit this morning when I got up after my appointment um, because I'm trying to get something removed from my ear. It's a keloid. It's not really that big but I just wanted to get it removed before I had the baby as you can see my son is watching TV <laughs> he wouldn't lay by himself so he wanted to lay with his mom um, so yeah so I read a little bit this morning but nothing else this has been a really bad reading month for me but I'm gonna try to finish it strong but yeah so I'm sure you guys will see me later on tonight Say hi. Say hi. Hi. Me and Daddy are gonna get some dinner because y'all is already cooking in the oven. Yeah, because we're hungry. We're so hungry. You already have food. Me and Daddy are gonna get some food. But I'm still hungry, Daddy. You haven't even eaten it yet. Daddy, I'm so hungry. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, let's take a look. I'm going this way. I ain't got time to wait. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Wait, you want to wear it? Sit back with us. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> hey, Kiana, can you pick up these pillows around the floor, please? Again? Yeah, it's your brother. Hey! Stop jumping off the couch. No, I am a bot. What? A bot. Where's your clothes? I don't know. What's that? Your baby's thing? Yeah, it's my baby's thing. Mm-hmm. DeAndre, don't you dare jump off the couch. <laughs> you did anyway. You did it anyway. Yeah, 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 yeah. Y'all yeah, need yeah, to clean, yeah. uh, clean up this room. You do. Pick up these pillows, right. Kiana. Ah! Y'all put a hole in the pillow. Oh, goodness. Y'all clean up. Sorry, Mom. Pick up these pillows. Ah! Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> okay, all right, Keandre. Oh, my God. He was so cute. All right, Keanu, do what I said, please. Okay. Don't you dare jump on her back. Why? Because I said so. <laughs> oh, that no, pick up the pillow. <laughs> <sighs> this is my life, you guys. My kids are my life. Yeah. But they can be a pain in the butt. <laughs> as far as cleaning up and him throwing oh things. God. Hey, pick it up, please. Oh, my goodness. <sighs> you guys. So... I didn't read last night, like after I had that great meal, which is called um, Grilled Cheese Gangsters. It was a food truck. Me and my husband went went to yesterday to get some dinner. Um, it was pretty good. Um, right after we ate, um, I was really tired. And you know, due to me being pregnant and eating some really good food, um, yeah, it just makes me really sleepy and tired and didn't read at all last night like I wanted to. So I'm so behind. I'm trying to at least read two books before June is up. Today is the 24th, 25th. I don't remember. I think it's the 25th today, but I could be wrong. I think it's the 25th. But yeah, so see, look, she she likes to be in the, in the video. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> What's your name? Kiana. Mm -hmm. How old are you? Uh. You know, you just had a birthday. <laughs> uh, count my, count my hands. Count. One, two, three, four, five. So how old are you? Five. Yes, good job. High five. All right, go play with your brother and clean up. But yeah, so I only got to page like literally. I'm so like, he's having a fit. But I only got to page 18 with this book, so I'm going to read up to page 200 today. That is my goal, or read even more, so that way I can read one more book before the end of this month is out. So at least I'll read no, at least four dead. or five books this no. month. That's the goal. Stop my kids are fighting. Stop. <laughs> but anyway, so Brother, this, stop. like I said, I only got to page um, 18, which is terrible. Um, but I'm definitely going to try to read up to page 200 today. So, fingers crossed, you guys, that I accomplished my goals. Oh, my goodness. Both of y'all stop. <laughs> All right. I will see y'all later on. I need to take care of these kids because they're fighting. All right. <laughs> All right, y'all. So, I am heading over to see my cousin and my baby cousin. My cousin just had a baby a couple months ago. Um, and she's so adorable. So this is the second time I'll be able to, I'm going to see her. So I'm on my way now to see her. So I'm driving.
But yeah, I'm driving right now over to her house. She literally lives right down the street from my parents' house, which is hilarious. I never thought, like, in her apartment, it's, I love it. I really do love it. Um, so let me see. All right. So that's where I am heading now. Um, I read a couple more pages or a couple chapters from the book. So now I'm just trying to read more. Like I said, get to page 200 or even more than that. Um, but yeah, but if you guys have read the book already, please share your thoughts with me um, about the book because right now it's, it's a little slow, I'll say. Um, Danny is definitely a very interesting and funny character um, in her way of thinking and everything like that and and bringing up like fate and trying to pretty much ask for hints give me a hint of when I'll find you know so-and-so or whoever um so yeah so yeah she believes in the fates and whatnot in other words but yeah so please let me know in the comments what you if you have already read it or you are reading it what are your thoughts about it so far but yeah so that's my update for now all right y'all is the 26th and I haven't gotten nowhere to my goal of reading this week it has been a failing vlog a reading vlog this week yes okay I'll get you your juice <laughs> so yeah it's been a failing week today but or this week but I'm hoping that I can read at least a, a little bit today and then, then tomorrow and then for Monday and then yeah read a little bit today and then tomorrow and Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday, read, I'm thinking, read a short, a short book, so I can at least squeeze in one more, um, but, yeah, I, I'm feeling, you guys, like, I just woke up, so I'm tired, and it's about to be noon, um, but that's how far I got to read this book, and I don't know why, I don't think I'm in a slump or anything, but I don't know what's going on with me, but, like I said, I'm gonna try to read a lot, um, a lot more today, um, just to see, but yeah, stay tuned, you guys. Hopefully, keep y'all's fingers crossed for me, please. All right, y'all, so I'm actually doing good. Um, I'm at a better spot in the book now. I plan on finishing this book tomorrow. I'm, I'm on page 102. I plan to at least be on chapter 12, which is on page 210. Um, so once I get there, I plan on pretty much reading the rest of the book tomorrow and then starting another book on Sunday and then cramming it in before the end of this month of June but so far it is getting really steamy with uh Saphir as yeah Saphir is off and Danny um with their little fake relationship sorry spoiler alert <laughs> but um it's really cute I really like this so much um I definitely could say that Zoff He's definitely more romantic than Red in the previous book, I think. Just a tad because he reads uh, romance novels. So he's definitely a romantic, which I like. You don't have a lot of men who are romantics um, and read books, <laughs> really. So um, yeah, so I'm loving this so far. It is a great book. So I'm definitely going to keep y'all posted. But yeah, so right now I'm trying to continue on reading um, and try to get to page 212 release a chapter 12 tonight but who knows I might read even more tonight just to get a little um a little step forward <laughs> so I don't have to read as much tomorrow but yeah so stay tuned for more you guys say hi Bubba uh, night 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 wanna go night night no can mommy read when you go to night night no no why okay cause what it's <laughs> you watching tv I got to page 150 last night, y'all. Didn't even get to page 200. So, probably going to be finishing the book tomorrow instead of today. 
Um, but then I'll just be pushing it to read one more book before end of June. But yeah, my kids don't want me to read. They just want me to pay attention to TV pretty much all day with them. But yeah, say hi. 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 And then you blow them a kiss. Blow them a kiss. Blow them a kiss. Not give a, do that. Do this. There you go. <laughs> Say bye. Bye. <laughs> okay, you guys, it is Sunday. I am reading, still reading, take a hint. Um, you know, take a hint, Danny Brown by Talia Hibbert. I am 67% done, almost done with this book. Um, as you can see, I'm almost done. Um, and so far, this book is really good. Um, I feel like I with Zoff his him having like I told you before he's a romantic and I love his way of thinking and Danny um she tries to put up this front but she is starting to have feelings for Zoff as well um and pretty much trying to go against her rules that she made while they were you know I don't want to spoil anything but you know what I mean about their relationship or their fake relationship um but I love this book so much I like the aspects of it um I think this is definitely there's a lot more I don't know there's a lot of passion but they have not pretty much confronted each other's feelings for one another I find that pretty pretty cute in a way um, because they're going around in circles they're thinking about each other like what this could be if this is a relationship and whatnot but Danny's going back and forth oh a relationship no not a relationship I just want the sex and all the other stuff um, and then Z Zoff all he thinks about is finding that one person in his life that he wants to be committed to and and just to live happily ever after since he is a romantic and he reads romance novels um but yeah so far so good I plan on finishing this book today um so I can read one more book before the end of this month um so yeah so far so good I am on page let's see I'm on page 243 and this book has a total amount of pages of 361 so I'm not that far behind um so I'm gonna finish this book um and then I'm pretty much next time you see me I'm pretty much gonna give you my review on this pretty much because I'm gonna be done with it <laughs> but stay tuned for more you guys <laughs> All right, what's up everyone? I finally finished reading this amazing book, Take a Hint, Danny Brown by Talia Hibbert. And oh my gosh, that's all I can say right now. Um, what I'll do is tomorrow, I'll pretty much give my review on both of the books since I read both of them of Get a Life, Chloe Brown and this. Um, so I'll pretty much will be ending that in the video with my reviews for both books since I read it. Um, read both of them this month so stay tuned for that you guys but I'm about to go to bed because I'm tired and my kids were running around acting crazy all day so <sighs> see y'all in the morning or tomorrow probably not in the morning but tomorrow all right y'all so th this was a very interesting vlog I I don't really do a lot of vlogs um, but I want to do more vlogs because um, my I feel like my weeks are interesting interesting sometimes um so I really need to get better at vlogging um but of course during my vlog I first read um Get a Life Chloe Brown by Talia, uh, Talia Hibbard and then I also read the second one is Take a Hint uh Danny Brown also by, by Talia Hibbard uh, which came out um later this month so I think like June the 23rd so right when I got it um in the mail I started reading it or I finished reading this and then I read this um so both of these all together I give these a five out of five out of five stars with this one this was very interesting I love Chloe and I love Red or Redford what have you um in their relationship I love the fact of how she has a chronic she was pretty much have, has an illness and she has to pretty much live with that illness but Red takes her for who she is she, he doesn't care he always accommodates her he's always considerate about how she's feeling or if she needs to sit down or whatever so I really enjoyed this book so so much um and the relationship is just so cute and also the whole concept of, of smudge the cat in there i loved it like 
so so much so i like i said five out of five stars for this book definitely recommended for anyone who loves adult romance um i need to get into adult romance more um i think that is the goal i want to be be more diverse in reading um or more diversely uh, when it comes to reading so i'm trying to do that um but yeah so this was amazing and then this one, oh my gosh, I love this so much. I love Danny and I love Zafir, or Zoff for short. I love the fact that she was um, driven to what she wanted to do in her life, but she had to figure out how to let people in her life and let people love her, which I really love the most. And Zoff, I love the fact that he, he read romantic novels and he's a romantic. I'm like, you never really see that in books or the ones that I have read. It's mostly the uh, female main character in the book that re is a romantic and loves romance novels. But it the it's been turned the switch to the but Zoff, he's the romantic. And I think with this book, I don't know, I love both of these as equal. Like they were really it was really interesting. I really love this a lot like it was just cute how there were pretty much faking relationship when really it was a real relationship they just never knew it um <laughs> they or they never admitted it to each other that it was really a real relationship in a way but anyways I love this book so much um I <laughs> I love the fact that we also have like with both of these books the men confess to the women what's what's happened in their life they confess a lot of men are very prideful and they don't really share what what's really how or you know what how they're really feeling in that moment and I feel like with these both books with Red and with uh, Zafir Zoff um, they opened up to Chloe Chloe and Danny about their feelings about the past what had happened with Red it was mostly his past relationship and everything that messed him up then with Zoff it was about him his father and his brother um dying in a car accident and so his career went downhill so I mean for both of these men to pretty much confess what they went through was amazing and I love it so much <laughs> like they do that because like I said a lot of men are very prideful and they just don't want to admit when something is wrong with them until they blow up or they do something stupid or say something dumb and they end up regretting it um but yeah so love these books so much thank you for pretty much for joining me on my crazy vlog this week um it's been hectic but <laughs> because I really didn't get a lot of reading done um in June I mean I read some I read a few books I mean I feel like I could read more but I'm just tired of my pregnancy I can tell like I, I'll be 36 weeks this coming Thursday today's the 29th um so of June so yeah so I'm just really tired and with the kids and everything I've been really drained and with COVID-19, with things, a lot of cases are now coming up again. And there's some states where they're closing down again. So it's just a lot going on. But if you love romance, or if you think you may, like, I feel like even if you don't read romance, this is very, very, very good or introduction into romance, in my opinion. I'm not really a romance uh, expert or romance novel expert, <laughs> but I definitely love these and I definitely look forward to uh, reading the third and final book of the Brown Sisters which we'll be talking about and the third book comes out next year and it will be about the youngest sister and the third sister Eve so I think that'll be really really exciting um but yeah so I love these books and I think the spines are also cute as well so yeah but that is it you guys I hope you enjoyed this vlog <laughs> interesting vlog um if you did please give a thumbs up also give me comments or anything that you could give me regarding vlogging what I could do better because uh, this was really interesting for me I really do not vlog that much um but yeah but if you like this video please give me a thumbs up also hit that subscribe button and that bell to be notified when I upload more videos in the future but thank you so much you guys see ya